video you can hear how I sound, so this is how I sound. This is a video in the game Roblox with a world game type thing of Project Track Day. Project Track Day is a fun game and we're going to be doing the race mode in GT3 at Hockenheim Ring and the Grand Prix layout. As we are now on the starting lights. As it's lights out and away we go as Crofty says and many other people say during races and stuff. Before turn one I get quite a good amount of positions, but then into turn one I decide to break even though you can take it fully flat at the start. But that's fine. If you will get penalties, then into turn one, all of the people ahead of me decide to go wide, so I just get a few more positions, and now I'm all the way up into first as we go into the fastest part of the track, I think. As I break quite a bit early for this turn, which uh, isn't the best, but I still made the corner. Sorry if I sound really quiet, I don't know if I should sound happier or bring the mic closer, it's one of those two. But I'm doing all fine, just minding my own business, and then second place just attempts to dive bomb me, but they just run wide and go fully off the track. So I'm all fine now, so might as well just continue going. But actually nothing else really happens in this race, so... Might as well just speed it up, mostly just get some slowdown penalties from just going wide or cutting the corner accidentally, probably accidentally. So, here you can see the final view of that, I guess. You can hear the dogs barking, uh, sorry about that. Unless you wanted to hear dogs barking in the background. But now we go through the final two corners of the race. And then a car ahead of me spins, but I slap them probably. I just do a few little things before winning the race and pass the line in first. So that's a first win in this first time. Now I try and figure out how to spectate. Just spectate all the other drivers doing their things, going to stuff and trying to finish the race, but I finish in first, which is cool. Now we wait for the Monza race to load, so it's sped up right now. Quite a long loading time, I think it's like 3-4 minutes maybe just to join one race. We get on the starting grid and we start in fourth, so let's hope for a good start. It's the final few lights and off we go to the race and we get the worst start ever. Losing three, four positions, but regaining one after someone lag. Now we head towards turn one, going at a lower speed so I break later than normal and everyone ahead of me just flies off everywhere. But I do get passed by one car, but I still gain more than I lost, so that's still more positions gained. And there's a driver that I'm guessing had to take a slowdown penalty, so they're slower on the fast part. As we overtake going through this turn, oh my gosh, someone just flew into the barrier. I hope they're fine. The game, I forgot. Obviously, they're going to be fine. There's another person just flies into the barrier. And two more over here. Three, no, just two. I did lose one position, but still a podium paying spot, so good for Monza. This is all in the first lap, so feels like a F1 online lobby. Very fun. Sometimes. As the driver head has to take a slow down penalty, so we get a free position. And I think the driver ahead of 
to me right now. Also, had they had a big enough gap to be fully fine. As we go for the last turn of lap one, as we made it to second place, so we gained more positions than we lost, which is good for me. This lap, I just said what I said earlier, but that's fine. Might as well just speed it up soon if I remember when I decide to speed it up. But nothing really happens for the rest of this, except I just continue, I think, in second, maybe drop down to third, I'm pretty sure it's second. But I just get a few penalties for um, time stuff. I'm probably blowing up the mic every time I say Because I just breathe a lot every time I say P. As we enter the last lap, still being sped up since nothing happens. There's a bit of action behind, but I can't see it. Got two corner cut slowdowns, but I, I end in second place, which is cool. Now we go to the Fuji Race Grand Prix, Grand Prix, sorry, Grand Prix layout with the GTE class. I take the Porsche since I like it the most. It's a good enough race. As we enter the lights, the race is gonna start now. As I get a quite good start, and there's a car in the ground, but I fly up into first place, which is good. But then into turning from. One, I break a bit early, but everyone else just flies off the face of the track in the earth. We're just going normally through here, and I randomly decide to sh downshift instead of just slightly letting off for this corner. Now I decide to run wide for no exact reason, and it really slows me down. I try and get back on the circuit, but I go too far on the gas pedal and it spins me. Then the car stalls. Since I'm playing on console though, they decide to not add anything to make you be able to turn the car back on so you can ba get back into the race, but that's fine, I'll just have to join another race. And this one's also in Fuji with the GT500 class, and this time I took, I think, a Honda. You can hear children. That's not epic. Anyway, as a start is not so good, I would not be happy with this start. With a really slow start, but I only lost one position. As we go into turn one, I lose many, but that's because everyone just decides to fly off the corner. By lose, I meant gain positions, but. Now as we go into turn 2, I weirdly enough decided to break and downshift instead of just slightly letting off. But this time I don't stall it on this turn and actually make the corner. And now when I meant to upshift, I accidentally downshift, which slows me down. Not the best thing for racing, but can still continue in the race. And I break way too late and fly right into the barrier thing, the chicane, the runoff chicane. I just go around it, which is not going to give me a penalty, weirdly enough. Now the lower speed part of the track, this is one of my favorite parts because it's quite flowy in the beginning, but later just to lose that flow. I get overtaken by the Supra, which is not the best for the race, and I run wide, but the Supra does spin, so that gets me back in position. Now, since I went wide, I do get the time, uh, not time, the slowdown penalty. But it's all good, I'm still up into second. So about doing the constant thing, it's probably sounding weird. Now as we enter into lap 2, I guess I'll just speed up the footage, because there's no real reason to keep at normal speed, because like all the other races are just loops, with me just constantly getting slowdowns. You might be able to hear my dog barking, that's 
kind of weird to go really wide back there, but that's fine. Now we passed the line, and I'm very disappointed because I did lose a position. This now I'm in third, so I decided to slam the car against the wall multiple times and probably destroy the engine. So, yeah, that was a quite a disappointing race, but still a podium, so still fine with me. <coughs> Sorry, I had to clear my throat. But now, since we are riding along with the Supra, thank you so much for watching the video. This will be probably one of the few, maybe many videos that has my voice in it, so. Yeah, but thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I hope you enjoy the video, and see you next time watching the other videos I have. Bye.